In the 1960s, marching bands began to take their performances beyond halftime football entertainment and started to create local competitions. Borrowing heavily from VFW drum corps events, the style was marked by its military heritage. Precision and pageantry went hand in hand, complete with starter pistols and the traditional presentation known as Off the Line. In the 1970s, marching bands organized competitive circuits around the country. Adjudication was aligned with the growing creativity of the designers, as less militaristic concepts made into the field. Popular components of the shows included the concert production. Here, the musicians demonstrated their playing ability, while the colour could dance and add character to the music such as this exciting Latin tune. The 1980s saw a revolution of movement in design as drum corps began to write kaleidoscopic whiplash motion to reflect the momentum of the music. The high school marching band activity became more physical as simultaneous demands of marching and playing were placed on the performer. The color guard became an important part of telling the story of these more complex shows. Hollywood and Broadway have always been a part of marching band productions. In the 1990s, the ideas of full field coverage and integration of the color guard yielded a more spectacular, lyrical, cohesive product demonstrated by this popular Disney soundtrack.
the new millennium, Trump Corps such as the Blue Coats have integrated what is referred to as the fourth dimension in our activity. The idea of layering and physically leaving the ground has become the standard. Additionally, the concept of driving the music visually is now how many shows are constructed, as all elements of design are interwoven into a singular concept.